little Marilyn. Hey, babe. She's tired and sore. A little soreness is to be expected. Isn't that what the doctor said? Yeah. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained, right, darling? Right. I'll see you later, right? Of course. Okay, bye. Mom, I told you I go by Marilyn now. Why haven't you called me in three weeks? Sorry, I've been busy. How are your acting classes going? Actually, I decided not to take any. Why? That's why you went to Hollywood. I've already spent the money, Mom. On what? On something that would advance my career. Sonnet said that if I... Who's Sonnet? Sonnet is a nickname of my new boyfriend. He's just the sweetest, most talented, most amazing man I've ever met. Now arriving. Did you make it off the subway train, dear? So I really want you to meet Sonnet. He's a very mature man. He's very romantic and really perfect for me. <sighs> Honey, that's your business. But I gave you money for acting school. If you don't want to go, you at least need to consider going to college where you'd learn some kind of profession. Mom, I don't need any college. I was one of the best students in high school and that's sufficient for me. So it says all I need to do is attend different parties, parties that big producers attend. I might meet one of them and they might say, baby, you've got the talent and the looks. I can make you the next Marilyn Monroe. Well, if Sonnet is such a wise man, he must be a doctor or lawyer. No, Mom, he's a poet and a very talented car detailer. And yet he doesn't want you to go to acting school to become a good actress? Marilyn, please, come home. Mom! Walter's waiting for you. Mom, please don't start this again. I'm not coming back home to our small, dusty town ever. Mom, I was kidding. God. What did you do with the money I gave you for school? I told you, I already spent it. On what? On something that would advance my career. Sonnet said that if I want to be a real star, I have to get a good facelift. A facelift? Yes, Mom. So, what else has this Sonnet been telling you that you need to fix to improve your looks. Sonnet says that if I want to have a serious career in Hollywood, I'll need modern boobs. Breast implants? Don't be so fashion, Mom. Don't you at least think that you should try to find a job first? I already have a job. I work in a coffee shop serving organic coffee to vegetarian customers. I also have a film audition tomorrow. Oh, okay. Is that for a, a film or are you an extra? It's a student horror film, and the role is half a minute long. I'm running for my life as a vampire chases me with a bloody knife. Well, that sounds kind of dangerous. Are they paying you well? No, Mom, I'm doing it for free. That's what you have to do to get your foot in the door. I just hope that director is not taking advantage of your youth and innocence. I know what I'm doing, Mom. Don't worry about me anymore, OK? I just. I just feel like I'm losing my little baby girl. Mom, I'm a woman now. Hello? Are you home, honey? 
No, I'm on Hollywood Boulevard. I'm meeting Sonnet. Oh, why? So he can give you more of his advice? Marilyn, please, come home. Walter is waiting for you. I don't, I don't love Walter. I love Sonnet. Will you just please promise me if it doesn't work out. Mom, I have something I need to tell you. What is it? Can you stop talking for like one second? I have something I need to tell you. Are you all right? I'm... What? I'm... What? Marilyn? Jennifer? Jennifer? My Marilyn. Who are you talking to? My mom. She wants me to come home. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She's old fashioned. Yeah? Yeah. So. How's my little one? <laughs> Good. You ready to show them how talented you are? I'm ready. 